How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some scary videos that are starting to spook the internet. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more freaky content. Just like this. In a spine-chilling incident, Reddit user AdorableRemove4539 shared some unsettling images from their home security system. The still, snapped from a front door security camera, depict what appears to be a white human figure perched on the back of a neighbour's pickup truck. The figure, which was invisible to the naked eye, only showed up in the camera feed, leading to widespread intrigue and speculation among the online community. The OP described an unsettling night in their post. Dogs were barking all night, went out to investigate, didn't see anything on the truck. I checked the ring camera and noticed it was still there. Freaked me out, not gonna lie. Upon hearing their dogs barking persistently, the Reddit user decided to investigate the disturbance. Despite their thorough inspection, the mysterious figure remained elusive to their direct view. However, each time they reviewed the security footage, the white figure was consistently visible on the back of the truck. Here's a comparison shot taken some hours later that shows the scene without the mysterious white figure. This inexplicable episode led the user to go back and forth comparing real-time observation and the digital evidence captured by the camera. Despite multiple attempts, the figure couldn't be seen in person but continually reappeared in the digital footage. The chilling images and corresponding narrative have sparked intense debate on the platform, prompting users to question whether the phenomena is a simple camera glitch or if it points to something more mysterious and paranormal. As of now, the incident remains an enigma, stirring curiosity and adding fuel to the eternal mystery of the unknown. This next one comes from popular YouTuber Dark Ghost Paranormal. In this episode, Dennis, the lead investigator, heads to a remote abandoned house that's been plagued by urban legends for years. Locals say that a man was found dead inside of the old decrepit house. The doors were locked from the inside and all the windows were sealed shut, yet there was evidence of foul play. Dennis enters the home in an effort to unearth what exactly happened here. I'm to what To start things off, Dennis sets up a spirit box session to try and make contact with any spirits that might be lingering on the property. It isn't long before a voice tells him to go away. Things take a turn for the terrifying when the spirit box session is cut short. Watch what happens. Watching that again, a knife flies across the room and embeds itself into the wall right near Dennis's face. A second stationary camera catches the knife zipping through the air from another room. Somehow, the OP finds the courage to continue the investigation. But soon, more strange activity occurs. The desk drawers inexplicably open. And 
and soon a wall of noise fills the room. Towards the end of the investigation, Dennis decides to scan the house with a thermal imager. That's when something truly terrifying happens. Nowhere, a face appears in the darkened room. <laughs> he flicks on the lights, but there's no one there. Spooked but determined, he tries scanning the room once more. This final encounter proves too much and Dennis quickly leaves the house. After some more investigation, it was discovered that the remains of a World War II soldier were allegedly unearthed on the property. So could this eerie activity caught on camera here have something to do with this discovery? At this stage, this disturbing encounter remains a complete mystery. In a photo that's stirring up significant chatter across social media platforms, a normal family day out fishing took a chilling turn. A seemingly innocent selfie taken by 13-year-old Haley Ogletree in Tifton, Georgia, has suddenly become an eerie artifact of the unexplained. The photo, capturing a joyful Haley after a day spent fishing at Paradise, a popular local spot, seems to hide more than it reveals. Just behind Haley, a spectral figure lurks unnoticed in the frame, standing next to her brother, Colton. According to the teenager's mother, the man wasn't with their group and there was no other people present at the secluded fishing pond. The family group only consisted of Haley, her brother Colton, and their grandparents, Dennis and Vera Baldry. Upon revisiting her photographs, Haley was taken aback by the mysterious man's appearance, which led to immediate calls to her mother and an unnerving revelation that has since left the teenager understandably unsettled. Critics have tried to debunk the ghostly figure as a digital manipulation, a common argument in the era of Photoshop. However, local accounts seem to corroborate the uncanny nature of the location. A local resident living close to the fishing spot has shared experiences of bizarre incidents in the area. One instance he cited involved the sudden disappearance of two elderly women who were fishing nearby. Despite their proximity and no evident means of departure, they vanished from his sight in a matter of seconds. While skeptics and believers continue their debate, Haley's picture stands as a chilling testament to the inexplicable. The Queen's Head Pub in Kings North UK has long been a source of paranormal stories and haunting legends. Staff and patrons alike have reported strange happenings on the premises, everything from disembodied whispers and inexplicable shadows to objects moving on their own. 
While it's mostly anecdotal, a recent piece of CCTV footage from inside of the pub seems to lend credence to the haunting tales. Take a look. Out of nowhere, a pint of beer topples over despite being on a flat surface. The owner of the pub has issued invites to paranormal investigators to come and check the property out, but so far no one's been game enough to take up the offer. So what do you think made the beer fall over? Could it really be proof that the pub is haunted after all? Let me know where you land on this one in the comments down below. This next curious piece of CCTV footage uploaded to YouTube by Paranormal News has been raising a few eyebrows. Take a look. The clip, which was captured by a security camera looking over a vacant lot, seems to show a dog morphing into a floating orb of light. Since going viral, a lot of viewers have been naturally skeptical of this strange footage. There's very little accompanying information as no one seems to know the exact location where the footage was captured. Furthermore, many think it's nothing more than two separate pieces of video clipped together. Either way, it hasn't stopped internet users from sharing the clip as it racked up thousands of views across multiple social media platforms. A strange incident that occurred at the Ronald McDonald House in Knoxville, Tennessee has caught the attention of many, inspiring conversations about the unexplained. The historic building, known for its philanthropic role of providing a home away from home for families with sick children, might be also hosting some unseen occupants. The incident unfolded on August 3, 2021, when a guest, staying while her daughter underwent surgery at a nearby hospital, noticed something unusual. It looked like somebody, <laughs> like somebody sat on the bed. I don't know, it was really weird. It was like somebody sat down on it. What the f***? Did you just see that? As she prepares for bed, she sees the mattress depress as if someone is sitting down on it. Oh no. Nope. Prompted by her avid interest in the supernatural, she decided to film the strange occurrence should it repeat. To her astonishment, the eerie movement occurred again, appearing as though an unseen figure was sitting down and then rising from the bed. Oh God. What? Eric, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. This unusual event left her with an uneasy feeling as she had to spend the night in that very room. The video clip of the anomalous activity has since circulated online, stirring viewers' curiosity and prompting many to suggest that the historic building might be haunted. The Ronald McDonald House, a landmark in itself, has a rich history. Built around 1903, it served various functions over the years, including operating as a boarding house for college students. Such a long history inevitably conjures up tales and rumours, often carrying a supernatural tinge that permeate the walls and halls of such venerable buildings. The recent footage provides a new chapter in the narrative of the historic Ronald McDonald House. Viewers of the unsettling video are left to draw their own conclusions. Is it an inexplicable ghostly phenomenon or merely an uncanny coincidence? Cast your votes on this one in the comments down below. So. What? Eric, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Before we take a look at some truly terrifying footage captured inside of a restaurant, remember to hit that subscribe button, then tickle that little bell icon there and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our creepy, mysterious videos. Our last clip of the day was uploaded to YouTube by Nix Maddock. It's some CCTV footage taken inside of a restaurant. To begin, we see some strange activity in the storeroom. A 
out of nowhere, the bucket and mop seemed to move all by themselves. However, what happens next takes this eerie footage to a whole new level. Watch. Watching that again, as one of the waitresses clears the tables, her hair appears to be yanked by some kind of invisible force. Here it is, slowed down. Luckily, the waitress was unharmed by this terrifying incident. However, she's at a loss to explain what actually happened. So what do you make of this? What pulled this poor woman's hair? Love to hear your theories on this one down below. Now, if you can't get enough of the old slapped ham, then don't worry, we've got you covered. Check out that creepy video on the top there. Otherwise, we have an enormous paranormal playlist there that'll keep you entertained well into the evening, we promise. Now, remember to leave us a comment down below and hit that thumbs up button. And that's it from me. I'll see you all next time. 